Welcome to Williamson County EMS Stop the Bleed Skills. How to apply a tourniquet. Tourniquets are used on arms or legs to control major bleeding. Remember, high to survive placement of the tourniquet. Doing so ensures the tourniquet is above the wound, not on it or below it. Tourniquets are painful, but should never be loosened or taken off after application. We will be demonstrating the use of a cat tourniquet. I'm Trenton Hernandez, captain with the Williams County Fire Marshal's Office. To use on an arm, slide the looped tourniquet above the wound. Place the tourniquet as high as possible. Hold the tourniquet in place and pull the end of the band as tightly as possible. Secure the self-adhering band from the buckle to the windlass clip, but not through it. Turn the windlass or rod to apply pressure until the bleeding stops. This often requires two or three turns. Then secure the windlass in the clip. Pull the remaining band through the clip and place the securing strap over the clip. Write the time on the tourniquet if possible. To use on a leg, open the tourniquet by removing the band from the friction buckle. Slide the tourniquet under the space behind the knee and then up the leg as high as possible. Wrap the band around the leg and pass the band through the friction buckle. Then bring the band back around the leg and pull it tightly. Bring the band to the windlass clip, but not through it. Turn the windlass until bleeding stops and secure it in the clip. If you have any band left, pull it through the clip and place the securing strap over it. Write the time on the tourniquet if possible. If severe bleeding continues, leave the first tourniquet in place and apply a second one directly adjacent and below it. The tourniquet should be as close together as possible. To complete your training, please attend a hands-on skills session. Contact your local EMS provider or hospital system.